How do cranberries grow? Cranberries are a fruit that grows on vines on boggy marshes. They are harvested from September to November. In this country, we often eat them during winter celebrations, such as Christmas. They're also an important fruit for celebrating a festival called Thanksgiving in Canada and the United States of America, where they grow 97% of the world's crop of cranberries. Cranberries don't grow from seeds. Instead, new plants are grown from cutting a piece of stem and leaf from an older plant. This is called propagation. The cuttings are put into the soil and soon they grow roots of their own and become baby cranberry plants. Cranberry plants can grow and bear fruit for many years. There are some cranberry plants in Wisconsin in the US that are 70 years old. Another place known for growing cranberries is Cape Cod in Massachusetts. Here, they plant new baby plants out in the fields each April. The plants like the ground to be really wet, acidic and sandy. They don't need lots of nutrients or fertiliser like some crops. The small pink flowers that form on the plants in June are where cranberries get their name from. Early European settlers in North America thought that the flowers looked like a crane's bill, so they called them craneberries. Once the bees have pollinated the flowers, the berries begin to form. They are white to start with, but slowly change to be bright crimson red. In September, it's time to start the harvest. In this field alone, there are more than 20 million berries ready to be picked and packed. There are two ways to harvest cranberries, dry harvesting and wet harvesting. These machines are dry harvesting the cranberries very carefully so they don't get damaged. When these crates are full, they weigh 400 kilograms each. That's the same weight as an adult female brown bear. They are lifted onto the back of a lorry by helicopter because a tractor driving through the field would crush the plants. Next, they are taken to the pack house for processing. For the wet harvest, this field has been flooded full of water. Then this machine loosens the berries so that they float to the top. The floating berries are gathered at the edge of the flooded field. Now the berries are being sucked up using these underwater pipes. The workers use the rakes to gently push the berries towards the pipe. Finally, they are washed before a conveyor belt transports them into a waiting lorry. These cranberries will be used to make juice and dried cranberries. Meanwhile, the dry harvested cranberries are washed and packed into these large crates, ready for the next stage of their journey to your Christmas dinner plate.